Yeah, hi there, and uh, these comments are for uh, Ciarhe, and I am Michael, the founder, owner, and the materials writer for all of your lessons at Stealth, the seven-step system to pass a TOEFL IBT. And um, in your specific situation, you want to get 91 points on the TOEFL. Your previous score is 76, so you have 20 points in the reading, 19 points in the listening, 18 points in the speaking, and 19 points on the writing. So, you have two to three months. Your question is, what can you, you say it, advice, you want to use the word advise, A-D-V-I-S-E, advice is a noun, advise is actually a verb there. So my advice to you would be three basic tips. Uh, number one, get in the habit of reading about 45 to 60 minutes every day or whenever possible. Very, very important. Number two, get, get in the habit of practicing listening every day for about 45 to 60 minutes. Now, when you're doing your reading practice, you can focus on newspapers, magazines, and also longer books. When you're doing your listening practice, you can focus on news, documentary history, and also science programs. Now, if you don't have English TV, you want to use the Internet, I have three specific websites that are beneficial to you. You might want to write these down. Number one, National Public Radio. Number two, TED Talks. Number three, Randall's Cyber Listening Lab. All these websites are very useful. Now, CRA, as you're doing the reading and the listening practice, get in the habit of note-taking. Focus on the main and the most important supporting points of those reading and listening passages. Now, of course, your notes in the beginning will not, will not be complete or accurate, but you'll get better in time. The main thing is to keep at it. So go through the reading and the listening practice every day. Now, each week, as, as you do the reading and the listening practice, use your notes to write three academic summaries of either a reading or a listening passage. Your academic summary should be approximately 250 words for each one. Now you're doing about 750 words of writing practice every day. Now, the next thing, you can also use your notes to orally speak about the information. Your speaking responses should be approximately 60 seconds. I recommend that you record your responses so that you can listen to them for either pronunciation, language use, or for your topic development, organization details, and so on. Those are my first two tips. So you do the reading and the listening practice, and then you do some writing and speaking about that material. The third thing is, CRA, is to begin going through the lessons in my 90-day TOEFL study guide. This is exactly the web page you're on. And the 90-day one is the <laughs> I'm recommending for you because you want to get approximately 20 points, 15 to 20 points higher on the TOEFL IBT exam. And most students who study diligently, most of them improve about 5 to 10 points for each month that they study. So by following those three steps, doing the reading, the listening, and then going through the lessons in my 90-day TOEFL study guide, that should help you uh, reach your goal. Now, my recommendation for my online TOEFL course is maybe spending about one to two days in addition to the reading and the listening practice you're already doing, maybe one to two hours each day going through the lessons in my 90-day TOEFL study guide. Alrighty. Anyway, thank you very much for your comments and uh, all the best to your high-scored TOEFL success.